boop 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 Uganda. Welcome back. On today's episode, we've got the Day State Wolverine R, a beautiful piece of craftsmanship. It's in midnight blue, 177. Let's take a look at some shots, take it to the range, give you a conclusion. This is the Day State Wolverine midnight blue in 177 caliber. A masterpiece of precision and craftsmanship that embodies the pinnacle of air rifle engineering. The stunning air rifle features a 43cm or 17 inch barrel, ensuring pinpoint accuracy with every shot. Weighing in at a manageable 3.4kg, it's perfectly balanced for both bench shooting and field work. At the heart of the Wolverine lies a regulated action, ensuring consistent shot power and superior air efficiency. This regulation makes it a premium choice for shooters who demand nothing but the best in performance. The Wolverine comes equipped with a precision engineered multi-shot magazine, allowing for rapid follow-up shots, making it ideal for both target practice and hunting. For those who prefer a more measured approach, a single shot tray is also included. With an integrated dovetail mount, the Wolverine is ready for any optic you choose, offering versatility for all shooting scenarios whether you're aiming for long range shots or locking in on smaller targets. Experience the precision, power and beauty of the Daystate Wolverine Midnight Blue in 177 calibre. Okay, so um, we are out here at 18 metres and the reason for that is just it was the easiest setup for me today. But uh, I have had this out to 40 meters. Didn't film that. It was not some uh, not an opportunity I could film at. But uh, since then I've taken the scope off and just put it back on. So we are going to have to go ahead and, and, and zero this once again. But what can I say? This is a premium rifle, okay? And I know there is a lot of day state users out there who will be looking forward to seeing this one. Uh, I have only shot a Huntsman Revere from day state before I got my hands on this one. And what can I say? Let's zero it uh, at this distance. As I say, it's 177, regulated, premium air rifle. Uh, you get two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 13 shots in the 177 rotary. And uh, super easy action, magnetic input, super smooth back. Wonderful piece of kit. So I've got um, some splat targets that I need to get rid of. I don't use them that often anymore, but I'm gonna go ahead and shoot it. Then we're gonna zero it, see, uh, see where we are, and uh, then finish up the magazine. But this uh, is pellet on pellet quality stuff. Okay, let's see where the zero is at. Okay, so we are very low. And then we need to move the point of aim to the right. Okay, second shot, middle of the target, aiming point. Nice. Could afford to come up a little bit. Run a group. I went really high again. <laughs> That's me, because I've zeroed it wonky. But we'll keep 
shooting on that aim point. Okay, what I'm gonna do is look at how that, where that is. So we're one and a bit mil dot. I'm gonna aim for the number eight. And then the other one on the left. The one at the top. One at the right. and then back down to the bottom. Round the clock we go. And I'm out. This rifle is an absolute dream to shoot. I've had one fill on this I've had about seven magazines through it and still got about another seven I could put through that. The shot count is high. The shot quality is unreal. At 40, it was 42 and a half meters specifically. Uh, it, what were we shooting at? We were shooting at clays. Uh, one clay stayed together, I made a smiley face and I accidentally hit a fly on um, a target at 28 meters. I don't know how it performed in 2-2. I don't know if you can get it in a 2-2. If I had the money, I'd be buying this today. Uh, what don't I like about it? The blue laminate is nice. I am a wood colored stock fan. This, however, is quite striking. I had people asking me about it. You've got multiple, multiply adjustable. So you can adjust the shoe trigger, you can move it forwards and backwards, and obviously the stages you can adjust. You have um, a nice thumb placement, on the trigger. You've got a nice uh, stipling effect here. It feels natural to hold at the shoulder. So, um, you know, obviously I'm leaning on the table, but if you wanted to take this out on a permission, I believe you could, uh, no problem. You have a, a mechanical cap for your quick release uh, fill port underneath. You have two manometers, one for your pressure, um, for, for your shot count essentially, one for your regulator. I haven't adjusted it because it's right for me, but you have an adjustable cheek pad here. I think, uh, yeah, I don't have the right tool to hand, but you get in the kit your single magazine, you get a single shot magazine and you get um, an adapter for the quick release regulator cap. This is my new favorite premium priced rifle. Uh, I'd love to take it out to a further distance of, a, of 100 meters, 100 yards. But for me, this is in my top five of rifles around the two to two 1200 price range but Wolverine R 177 is a banging rifle if you're looking for that price range this is your this is ah uh, is it your one probably not the right terminology this stay pro x uh I'd go for this just prefer it just prefer the look and feel I like the action uh think you can adjust which side it goes on if you wanted to. Uh, don't quote me on that. 
but yeah. You can go and check this out at thesurplusstore.co.uk or go in store, get hands on with it. They are available now, but I do believe they're limited. So if you want one, go quickly. As always, thank you to the surplus store for letting me get this in hand. I, I feel entirely privileged. It's a beautiful piece of kit and uh, I would be jealous for anyone who does pick this one up. As always, thank you for you guys to watch in. Uh, always more content coming up. I tried to post as much as I can, uh, busy lifestyle and all that, but uh, this rifle and many more will continue to be here on YouTube for you guys to see. As always, shoot safe, stay safe, catch you on the next one. Cheers!